Hello and welcome to the new season of 2015 on Swift TV. I'm Blair Jacobs, once again at Swift Group's headquarters in East Yorkshire. Now you may remember that last season on Swift TV you'll have seen several films about Pure, the new system that replaced timber in the manufacture of caravans. Well for 2015, Pure is now standard in coach-built motorhomes as far as the Swift Group is concerned. I've been speaking to Chris Milburn, Swift Group's design director, about why Pure was chosen to replace timber. In this first film of the season, you can see why, and also the tests that were undertaken to prove its moisture resilience. Well, Blair, we've, uh, we've set up some demonstrations, so let me show you uh, why we've, uh, we've chosen Pure. Um, the first test is uh, a particularly extreme test, um, where we see how the materials uh, absorb water. So first and foremost, we start with uh, the three materials. We've uh, measured each of them for water content. We've then weighed them. And then we put them in a container and pour over the top of the container uh, water, which has got food dye in it to make it uh, easier to see and we'll leave those submerged in that water for up to six hours to see which, ones of the, which of those materials absorbs the water the most. Tell me about the second demonstration. Well Blair, the, the main concern that uh, we have with blowing polystyrene is the fact that it uh, has veins in it. I've got an example of, uh, of some here. Um, and those veins, uh, if water were to get in, which it could do potentially through a, a screw screwing into uh, the material, water tracking down the screw and into the material, then it could drain into other parts of the caravan, in particular the floor and, and, and those other areas. So what we've got here is we've set up a, a demonstration uh, where we've taken three pieces of material, timber, pure and uh, blown polystyrene, and we've, we've drilled a little well in the top and uh, we've inserted into the top of that a, a plastic tube. Now we'll fill each of those uh, um, tubes with water, with dye in it. Uh, first the, uh, the timber, uh, secondly the pure, and then last of all the blown polystyrene. And you can see that the water has run right through the blown polystyrene and out of the bottom, um, but on the other two, the timber and the uh, pure, the water is still in the tube. Now we'll make a mark on that um, and we'll come back uh, in a few hours time to see how that uh, water level is, uh, as if that water level has dropped. Okay, Chris, six hours have passed now. Uh, talk me through the results. Well, let's go through the first experiment. To make sure there's no excess water left on the, uh, on the pieces, they're first dried, and then we check the moisture content. Not surprisingly, the uh, timber showed a marked increase from 8% to 25%, but the pure and the blown polystyrene showed no change at all. The pieces were then weighed. The timber increased by 10%. The pure remained as it was at 41 grams, and the blown polystyrene increased by nearly 30%. The blown polystyrene uh, result reinforces what we saw earlier, that water can run into the material, um, but also it can be retained by the material. After six hours, the, the level of the water in the pure tube has remained unchanged but what we can see is that the level of the water in the uh, timber tube has actually reduced slightly. So what does all this tell us then? Well, what it tells us is that timber does absorb water, but at a relatively slow rate. What we can see from the blown polystyrene is that water does enter into the material and is retained by the material. This can potentially leak out at a later date or, uh, or could indeed freeze. Uh, and what we can see by the from the experiment is that uh, pure doesn't absorb water at all. Well, as you can see, the results are amazing. And as I mentioned before, the Pure system can now be found on all Swift Group coach-built motorhomes. And don't forget, as usual, you can find all the specifications, details, layouts and prices on the website, swiftgroup.co.uk.